Cops land search for a three person of interest from West Kingston. Investigators in Kingston Western Division have listed three men as persons of interest in the probe of an incident that occurred in Trenchtown, Kingston on Sunday, June 13. They are Kimo Roach, Kimo Tingle, otherwise called Not Nice, and a man known only as CJ. All three are therefore asked to return to the Denham Town Police Station by 6 pm on Monday, June 14. In addition, anyone who can help the police to locate or contact any of the individuals listed is asked to contact the Denham Town Police at 876-948-6443. The police emergency number at 119 or visit the nearest police station. Man held and firearm and ammunition seized in targeted Constant Spring Red. One Glock pistol along with 26 rounds of ammunition was seized during targeted raids in Constant Spring on Sunday, June 13. One man was arrested in connection with the seizure. Reports from the Constant Spring Police are that between the hours of 10 pm and 11 pm, police searched approximately nine premises in the communities. The firearm and the rounds of ammunition were seized in the area occupied by the suspect. His name is being withheld pending further investigation. Two people get slapped away in Westmoreland since Saturday. Investigators from the Westmoreland Police Division are now probing two separate incidents that occurred in different sections of the parish between Saturday night and Sunday morning. The police identified the deceased as 38 year old Orlando Owell of Atfield District and 19 year old and employed Anthony Greer, both in Westmoreland. Reports from the Negril Police are that about 10.30 pm on Sunday, Owell was standing along the Straw Boogie Roadway when he was pounced upon by our men. He received several cans to the upper body and was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced. On Saturday at about 6.15 pm, reports are that Gray was among a group of friends in his community when four men alighted from a motor vehicle that was driven up and opened fire. The police were called and upon arrival, Gray was found suffering from what appeared to be wounds. No motive has yet been established so far for either incidents. More details will be provided soon. St. James security guard allegedly found with firearm and ammo. St. James police have arrested and charged 29 year old Miguel Keldo, a security guard of Albion in the parish following the seizure of a firearm and ammunition on Saturday, June 12. Keldo has been charged with illegal possession of firearm and illegal possession of ammunition. Reports are that about 10.45 am, a police team acting on information went to where Keldo was working. He was accosted and searched along with a black backpack belonging to him. A pine tree zero pistol with three pine tree zero cartridge were allegedly found. Kello was then taken to his house where a search was conducted and two camouflage jackets and a pair of camouflage pants belonging to the Jamaica Defense Force were found in a closet. A date for his appearance in court is being finalized by the police. Yeah man my people, my love how the J safe them and deal with the road from out there. Only for firearm them are seized and them look at things there. Only for illegal firearm and illegal ammunition. Yeah man, so it's a good look that. You see me? We only hope say them can't enough to find these firearm and ammunition and destroy them. Yeah man my people, so that is definitely a good look for the Jamaica Constabulary Force. For Jamaica. Yeah. So you can leave it in the comment section and let me know. What are you not at when these incidents will take place? Especially the incident in Westmoreland where two people drop out. But why people? Every day are the same thing. I can't tell when last we hear something good come out in the news. Yeah. I bear them sad story. It's very sad. As I say, leave your opinion in the comment section. Let me know. What do you think? Subscribe to the channel if you're new and click the bell. Until the next time, you know where to go. I'm out.